Hello, brothers and sisters of light and dark. Welcome, welcome to my page. My face my comments. I try to keep it down. Need to get here under ten minutes. If it goes over ten minutes, I'm very, 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 very important. Not important to liberals, libertars, people who believe God, people who smoke, people who drink, people who ayahuasca, people who DMT. Listeners' discretion is advised. What's this. Listeners' discretion is advised. If you have any comments, questions, insults, or roast you put it down below. I'd be friendly, maybe it's schizologist. I am not a pimp. Please do not call me a pimp. I'm more on the gigolo side, but I can't do that shit now because I got my daughters. Okay, and I believe I'll wait. I'll raise my daughters pretty well because my daughters are pretty attached to me. Because I teach them things and they learn their lessons and their manners very early on. And um, if you've been watching my videos, you know I'm the real McCoy because I have videos to back up everything I say. Also, check my credentials in the description box. I also have a Patreon. The Patreon is basically, there's four tiers to the Patreon. The first tier is about different videos, okay? The second uh, 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 second tier is basically you get the videos and you go to the group site and stuff like that. Okay, and, and, you know, just read the tiers. The fourth tier is the best. It's $15 a month. I can give you therapy and stuff like that. Yada, yada, yada. Please read it. You're going to be able to get in touch with me. Yada, yada, yada. Please read the tiers. Now let's get on with the subject right here. Um, how to tell, so I'm a, I'm a title of this video, how to tell if you're a beta alpha or an alpha male, depending on how you look at women sexually. Okay. So I, I made that very clear in the beginning. Okay. Now, a, a beautiful woman. Okay. By most men's perspectives, by 80%. Most of you guys are beta alphas. Because the first thing you see when you see a woman, you think, how juicy is that pussy? How big them bubble butt titties are? Okay? When you see a woman, you basically judge them according to their body at that time and moment. But be most beta alphas just think like that and they stop there. They think about how good she's probably going to be. Okay, most beta alphas think like this. I asked a guy one day, I say, damn, she does have a tight little body, I said. Okay, right? And he's like, yeah, I want to hit that. That's a beta alpha male right there. And then I asked the question, like, why do you want to hit that? You know? Now, a guy like me who's an alpha, I'll be like, that's an alpha trait to ask the question, why you just want to hit that? You don't know where she's been at, okay? Right? So now you understand that I made that quick, quick and very simple and short for most of you guys. Stop it. Stop. Eh, you know, you're, you're thirsty like a motherfucker, man. You say some shit and then I'll ask you, because I'm alpha. I'm like, why would you want to lick? This guys who tell me straight up, they eat that ass, okay? Because that ass look nice. I say, are you joking, right? You will really do that, okay? <laughs> right, right, right. So I'm like, I've seen all sorts of ass on porn, but I'm like, damn, dude, you know, you see her, but you just want to say all that shit in front of me as an alpha? And I'm saying, you got to control yourself. That means their urges are uncontrollable. And they will do anything for a booty that tight. You understand the psychology now? So in short, alphas ask questions on why you want to hit that. You know, they ask deeper questions and say, hey, that booty been all around the world. They'll probably say something ignorant like, nah, she ain't my type. Because that's alpha, you know, ain't got no time for that booty to be shamed. You know, that stink booty gonna be walking around everywhere. That's an alpha for you. And that stink booty ain't mine. I would never own it. That's an alpha speak. But beta alphas will be like, damn, I wanna hit that shit, man. Yo, that shit, I don't give a fuck what she does. She can pee on me anytime. Now, I, I'll be asking, are you joking? You, are you serious? Okay. You want that bitch to pee on you after she been drinking and sucking dick all her life? Okay, are you serious, man? I don't give a fuck what these alphas, these beta alphas be saying. Those beta alphas talk like that all the time. Tattoo looking motherfuckers with their head cat turned backwards and shit. Like that. Seriously. I can tell you some shit that I saw in my life. One day I went out there, I was in North Carolina, and I went to some sort of club for the first time. 
And this guy said, this dude only fucks with virgins. And all of the girls did is suck his dick. He had them on a roll. And he don't never fuck with one female. And they're all virgins. They bleed. Virgins bleed. Okay. They don't have sex with him. They just suck his dick. And then I talked to him. I said, hey, you know, give me some advice. That's all I asked for. Because I couldn't get near him because it was so packed and shit. I said, please give me some advice. I'm just a neat, a, a nerdy, geeky, geeky guy in college. Okay. North Carolina. He said, hey, travel overseas. I said, oh, okay. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Okay, don't get, don't touch the used vaginas. Okay, don't touch them. Okay. I was like, what the? That's alpha, right? All right, so since I gave you education, you guys here, um, that's how you can determine if a guy is a beta alpha, beta alpha simp, beta alpha playboy or fuckboy. It's so what they see out of their mouth. Now, it depends on if they're joking about it and shit, and they're not coming to terms what they said, okay? All right? They're not coming to terms, because I do it all the time. I'm like, what do you mean you're going to eat? You, you want her to pee on you? What do you mean you want you want to fuck that no matter what happens? I don't care if she had 15 babies. I'm going to smash that. There's a lot of you 80% of guys out there who talk like that. Showing off your women and shit. And showing off your prostitutes sitting on your side because you need validation just to show off. Those are beta alphas. All of you. So if you want to fix that problem, you don't need that image to be out there. It's okay to go to a little honey like I did in Ethiopia and tell her to shoot some hoops and shit. And I could see her body naked and oil went down. But I don't fuck use vagina. She wasn't no virgin. The girls I show on my videos are not fucking virgins. I swear to God. But they smell better. Okay. I'm not interested in hitting. They even ask me. But of course. Girls in foreign countries don't really suck dick like that. So you got to teach them and tell them it's, it's not an option. Okay. Okay. It's a choice. They don't want to do it. You out of there. Women, most of the time, they don't understand. Women who are innocent, okay, overseas, don't understand that they got to suck a dick for it to get hard. They don't know that. That's the first process. It just doesn't get hard. There's women out there who think it's supposed to automatically be hard. <laughs> yeah, seriously. I run across them all the time. I'm like, oh, he better fuck me. Like, I'm not sucking nobody's dick. I'm like, I be coming across some weird ass females. Females tell me, I like to be raped. I want to go to the club. I want to go to the bar and get raped and, and keep going back. But you don't believe me because you don't know who I am. I'm a therapist to women. I used to talk to them all the time. Come to my inbox, pay me my dues in my Emerald Pillar. Alright? But I know I'll be popular later on. I'm just giving it some time. I got my shit still there. It'll be there. I'll blow up when I'm getting older. I'm 47 this year. I got three more years. I'll be rich before I'm, in, I'm 50 years old. I know I will be. I feel strongly. Okay. But of course, um, in the meantime, I'm already kind of rich anyway. Because, you know, I'm in America. Okay, and I traveled overseas and I feel wealthy over there every time I go over there. But I'm talking about super wealthy. You guys have to pay up your dues. Alright. But I, I hope you understand anything, everything I said. Um, beta alpha males speak that way. And alpha males don't speak that way. It is completely clueless on why you say that until you explain. You better be joking. Okay. But other than that, let me get the hell out of here. I hope you learned something. Let me get me something to eat now. Peace.